In this video, we will be providing an overview on how you can add notes to your CRH model. Adding notes to your CRH model is important for a couple of reasons. First, it allows the person who is evaluating your model to have a clear understanding of why you set certain parameters or K bases. Second, it allows you to be able to look at a model you created months or even years ago and be able to quickly remember why you set the model the way you had. Now you can set notes at a two levels. The first level is at the element level. If we select an element and then select the note options under the home tab, you'll see this edit notes and attachment windows pop up. In this first area, you'll be able to capture notes such as we may say based on space guidance. Using this top part, we can format what we have just written in a number of ways. In addition, we can also capture the date and time by using this date and time stamp. And finally, if we want, we can even insert a link from our computer. And so if we click on this and then select one of the other sample projects, we can insert that link into this note, file, uh, note section. Now, one of the downsides to this is if your file is on your computer, when you hand this model off to another user, they will not be able to access this file. In that case, you may wanna use the attach file option below. By hitting attach file, we can again attach this file and you'll see it appear down below. We can actually attach multiple files too. We can also delete any files that we don't want. And finally, we can open up an attached file. Now it is important to note that each project has a limitation of 100 megabytes worth of files that can be attached. The last thing that's worth noting is that when we exit out of this or hit OK, you will see next to that element a red paper clip. This red paper clip will signify the fact that there is an attachment with it. If we go back here and we actually remove this file, that paper clip is now gone, yet the note is still there. You can easily see the note by either going back to the note section and clicking on it, or if you hover over the element, you'll see the note appear in a drop down window. You can also add notes to the parameters themselves. If you double click on any parameter, you'll notice that you not only have access to the inputs, but off to the left, you have a note section. And again, you can add notes to the section. If you click on this note and attachments, you will have a more detailed section where again, similar to the last one we had, you can adjust the Format here, you can add a date and time, you can insert a file, or again, you can even attach a file. Once you hit okay, your note will appear in that note section. We hope you found this section on adding notes to your estimate helpful. And as always, if you have questions or concerns, you are welcome to reach out to the Galarath support team.